Hashtag Illuminati. Yeah, that's all me, boy. So, Hashtag Illuminati is uh, me, basically. Uh, no, it's, it's what it is, is I looked into Illuminati a little bit here and there. I'm gonna stop walking, I don't want it to be all shaky. Hold on, bud. Jack, come here. So Illuminati is, uh, Jack, hold on. We're gonna stop for a sec. Illuminati is basically, I think I have a mosquito in my hat. <laughs> I can't even start talking about Illuminati. I might get assassinated. No, I'm just joking. But uh, Illuminati is something that I made because my name is Nathan, which is, you know, I, my nickname is Nate. So Illuminati is a, uh, you know, is another representation of myself. And I actually wanted to turn this into something after a while, I, you know, after a while of thinking about it, you know, sometimes you just say little puns, I guess. I don't know if that's a pun, but you say little things or puns like that. You're like, oh, Illuminati instead of Illuminati. So I, I started going around my, my family members, particularly my brother, Jacob, and I, he would mention Illuminati a couple times. And, I, and whenever he did, I would say, nope. Oh, get it right it's illuminati so i just kind of teased the idea so he basically helped me formulate it along with his he had a uh, with his significant other and uh so so yeah basically him or them they them them both uh, both of them helped me formulate the idea uh, just just by mentioning it a few times. I mean, I don't know when I first thought of it, but they helped me actually think of it as like a, a real organization or a business. And so let me let me get into the pudding now, I guess you could say. Let me, let me get into the sauce. So instead of it just being Illuminati, something that I want to make, I made it Illuminati where everybody has the same name. And you can only join if you have the same name. You have to have the name Nate, Nathan, or Nathaniel. And there's a total that I know of, that I'm aware of, of 11 different ways to spell Nate, Nathan, and Nathaniel. So, with that said, I have websites. Get out of that, that's poo poo. So I have websites, right? I have a bunch of different websites. And, you know, instead of, you know, like, they're not my websites, but all these different, like, fairly, uh, fairly popular social media websites I use, generally. Uh, or even some of the unpopular ones, like Pinterest, for one. I, I don't think many people are into that. I don't know. I don't want to call it unpopular. But, anyways, um, it's not as common, I guess. So, instead of me naming my websites or my profile names or account names after myself or like my xbox live gamer tag in8k or inn8k i had two different gamer tags there they're they're both mine so uh instead of instead of fully just representing myself and and doing the common traditional thing on the internet where if you're trying to build your online presence you're usually representing your first and your last name or some sort of nickname or in my case, a gamer tag for, for Xbox uh, or, or whatnot, or maybe, you know, uh, YouTube and stuff, you know? So yeah, uh, instead of just representing myself, what I'm doing is I'm building a business, so to speak. But I like to call it more than just a business. It's like, you could just name it any, a charity, uh, an, ar an army, a, you know, a business, um, like a nonprofit charity though, I don't know, you know? Uh, a nation, a religion, you know, it's, there's just, it's just so many things at once. And, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I think I was going somewhere with that, but, uh, you know, I, I don't know. There's just so many different things you could, you could basically, hold on, Jack, I want to check out some of this graffiti real quick. Yeah, so, um. And I want to slow down a little bit. I'm kind of talking a little. Yeah. Uh, all those things I mentioned. Like, it, it could be a country. It could be a nation. Like, like a, 
continent. It could be a religion. It could be. It's all. It's everything. It's like one big thing. It can't be just a business. It can't be just an organization. It, it's many things in one. Uh, to kind of elaborate further, Jesus Christ was a story. God is non-existent. So I'm essentially. I don't want to call myself atheist. I don't like labeling myself, but. You would be overworking your brain if you were to pray to God for 90 years and you'd end up just, you'd overwork your brain. And so I know God is non-existent. Jesus Christ was just a good story, I guess. Yeah. So anyways, not to, not to demean his, his ideology or their ide ideology, but um, God is non-existent and people shouldn't be overworking their brain praying to something that's not there. Uh, but I kind of went off topic there. But... I'm fairly on topic because I'm talking about my name in the biblical meaning. So my name, Nathan, or, you know, my name, my full name is Nathan. It's not Nathaniel, but anyways, the name Nathan or Nathaniel in the biblical meaning means gift of God. So, uh, essentially I'm a gift of God. And if I'm making Illuminati a place where, you know, uh, uh, I don't want to call it a place, but a a creation where everyone is welcome, essentially, ever, literally, you could change your name to Nate, Nathan or Nathaniel anytime you want. You just go to, uh, I think it's namechange.org, and then you just search your state, and it's like 30, 40 bucks. You, can, you could be a female, you could be a male, and you could just change your name to Nate, Nathan, or Nathaniel, and you could be a part of Illuminati. That is perfectly fine with me. And basically what I plan to do is just help everybody out, everybody out, you know, Help, help out just basically keep searching people with those same names and help them out and that's that's illuminating uh but back to the gift of god thing yeah that's pretty important where if you know I, it's hard to even kind of speak upon it now that i within the past within the past year or two i've realized that god is non-existent uh but Regardless, there's still meaning behind everything for the most part. Um, so if I'm a gift of God because my name is Nathan and that's the biblical meaning of my name, then every single person that's in Illuminati is also a gift of God. And then you could look at it as like a, like a, I came from a Christian or Catholic type of a family, right? So a Christmas tree, like just think a Christmas tree or whatnot has a bunch of it has whatever religion it is that you celebrate you know no discrimination there's a bunch of you from what i from what i from my own personal experiences or from my experiences uh there's gifts under the christmas tree and so if nathan means gift of god and i make illuminati and we're a huge group of gifts of god then essentially we're an everyday christmas type of a deal so I'll have to read the Bible one day and learn about Jesus Christ himself, but the whole God thing, I could go step on some ants right now. I could go step on a bunch of ants and kill them. You know, go to, go to, like, you know, go to, go pour some Kool-Aid on the ground or, or go, go throw some food on the ground and have a bunch of ants clutter around the food and then I could just step on all of them and kill them. That's not, that's not godly. God wouldn't let that happen. So, you know, that's one way, you know, the, the whole brain, overworking your brain thing is one, one way I know. And then the, you know, stepping on ants thing is the other way I know. So, yeah, but this is about Illuminati. So Illuminati is, is pretty cool. Uh, I really enjoy it. I don't, you know, I don't really plan to profit from it. I, I you know, I just try to keep it part of basically half of me. Ha Half of my representation is Illuminati. And uh, what I do is I go to these different websites like Twitter or Pinterest or whatever it is. Um, YouTube, Xbox Live, Rockstar Games. And I search people with those same names. N8, N-A-T-E, Nathan, Nathaniel, and all that. Nate, Nathan, and Nathaniel. And there's, you know, there's like people out there, like rappers, Nate Dog, and all that, right? So. There's, so there's really just like so many different ways to search uh, the word Nate or Nathan or Nathaniel. 
especially because like there's like Nate the Great and stuff like that. So, or of course, like I said, Nate Dog. So yeah, that's what Illuminati is, hashtag Illuminati. And I'll tie this in with hashtag Nate Nation, which is just another form of saying Illuminati. Uh, Nate Nation, hashtag Nate Nation is spelled N8, N8, I O N. So instead of N A T E, N A T E, I O N, or I mean, N A T, uh, N A T E, N A T I O N. You know, instead of the regular way of spelling Nate and then Nation, I spell it with N A T, N A T, and then I O N. So it's pretty clever, and it's a short hashtag, so it's not too, it's not taking up too much of your time if you were to want to search it, type it out, you know, search it or type it out. So. Yeah, that's hashtag Illuminati, uh, my creation. And I plan to never stop, you know? I plan to continue to help other people around the world named Nate, Nathan, or Nathaniel. So yeah, if you wanna join, go to namechange.com, uh, namechange.org or namechangeresources.org or something like that. And then you can change your name and then you can join. Just ask to join and um, uh, I'll welcome you with open arms. Thank you for tuning in to the visualization, and that's what hashtag Illuminati, hashtag N8N8ION, Nate Nation, Nate Nation means. And again, thank you for tuning in to the visualization.